Hello everyone. Thank you for coming up today. Welcome to Rainy Storm channel. To my old subscribers, thank you. And to my new subscribers, thank you. And to those that have been for the first time or that have not subscribed, please do click on the subscribe button and also the notification bell so that you will get notified each time we upload a new video. On those states, NURTW officer's wife shot dead by an unknown gun man. That's the top officer of the National Union of Road Transport Workers in on those states who goes by the name Comrade Marcos following shore. His wife was shot dead by unknown gunmen at night last night. Wow, this is really sad. And his wife is a middle-aged woman who has been identified as Mrs. Fumi following shore and they reside in Akure Ondo State. However, she was shot dead inside her car approaching her home at Oda Road in Kajola area of Akure. And that was around 10 p.m. yesterday, Monday, being the 28th of December, 2020. It was also um, gathered that the assailants, that the people that killed her, the gunmen, followed her to her house from an undisclosed location then killed her at the spot they were actually trailing her following her footsteps or following every move she made and that was how they got to know where she was going to and then they didn't hesitate they killed her instantly oh this is really really sad such a pain oh why why would people go into such act and her husband is um, a top officer of the National Union of Road Transport um, Workers. It is so sad. Now they will leave um, their daughter behind without a mother and the husband without a wife. It's so terrible. Seeing things like this, it's so heartbreaking. You just kill innocent people for no reason. However, she was buried today. You can see the grave where they're actually digging the grave in her compound. This is really sad. May the soul of Fumi Falonri shall rest in perfect peace um, with the Lord. It's truly really a painful exit. You can imagine getting to the new year after the Xmas celebration and then gone down. A lot of people have been paying tributes and extending their sympathy. We extend our sympathy to the husband, to the family, the kids, the entire family and friends. May God console them. It's a very painful loss. So painful. So she wouldn't get to see the new year. Such a young, beautiful woman. I just pray that those responsible are apprehended. Friends, if you have anything to say, please you could leave your comments at um, the comment section below. It's just like... People will just be living in fear because you don't know what the next thing that will come your way. May God keep protecting us. We need, all need to keep praying for God's protection because it's only God that will protect us. We don't know what the next minute will be, but God already knows. We don't know what the next hour will be or whoever is after your life or after our lives. But we just keep praying that God Almighty should keep us safe and protect us and our families. It's really sad. Thank you for coming up today. Please, for those that have not subscribed, do click on the subscribe button and also the notification bell so you get notified each time we upload a new video. God bless you all.